but four, it is a heartbreaking tragedy for the family of one high school student and two other young people must be traumatized after a deadly accident in Macomb Township. Our Nick Monticelli is live near a memorial for the 14-year-old girl who died this morning. Nick? Karen, just an unbelievable tragedy today. Not only do you have the 14-year-old girl who was hit and killed, but two 16-year-old classmates inside of the car that killed her. So a lot of people affected here. Now, there are two little memorials set up, one on one side of the road near where that Jeep stopped, the other near the driveway of her parents' home where she barely made it out of before she was hit and killed. Watched her grow up become the little girl that she is, the teenager that she became, the sophomore in high school that she was great friends with everybody. Scott Goodhue is best friends with Victoria Cartwright's parents, and as you can imagine, their world has fallen apart. This morning, Victoria was hit and killed when she was walking to Dakota High School. She's a sophomore there. She barely made it out of her parents' driveway before she was hit by a Jeep. Making it worse, inside of that Jeep were two girls 16 year old classmates. Her friends say the mood today inside of Dakota High was incredibly somber. This morning I heard it, it was devastating because it doesn't feel like it's real. But just thinking about it, it could have been anybody. There are small memorials on either side of the road near where she passed away. Not too subtle reminders, her friends say to hug your kids tight. Love your children, hug them every day and tell them that you love them. Even if you're mad at them or if they're mad at you, just make sure that you know that they love each other. Now Dakota High School is playing a semi-regional playoff football game tonight at Utica High School. Actually, it's against Eisenhower played at Utica. So the students and faculty will be there wearing all whites to honor Victoria and try to honor her memory. Now coming up on Local 4 at 5 o'clock, you're going to hear more from this family friend and what the family wants those girls who are inside of that Jeep to know. We are live in Macomb Township. Nick Monticelli, first at four. All right. Thank you, Nick.